Oh yeah, so let's get into some smaller news. Um, have you heard about what happened with FEMA this week, Michael? The crazy shit that uh, FEMA just Liberty me just out here like fucking up, like big time fucking up. How? All right, so they hired this woman. Uh, what is her name? Tiffany Brown. Tiffany. Tiffany Brown, uh, Atlanta businesswoman. One person owns her own business. Mm-hmm. Now, I'm going to explain to you where her Twitter account says she is. Uh, let me sit back for this. <laughs> she is an entrepreneur, mm-hmm. uh, a mogul, mm-hmm. businesswoman, mm-hmm. and some other bullshit. You know, the black women, so I'm the shit her, blah, bitch blah, 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 blah. type shit. I'm that bitch type shit. Okay. Uh, FEMA gave her $156 million to help feed Puerto Rico, the Puerto Rico crisis. Uh-huh. She failed. She, she gave one, they gave one person a $156 million contract to do that, to feed Puerto Rico. Okay. During the crisis. Shit went left. So Completely she- left. So left that they already paid her two hundred fifty five thousand dollars. They paid her two hundred fifty five thousand dollars off top, but she she contracted someone from another company that is ran by eleven people. That's twelve people all together. Okay. With one hundred fifty three million dollars to feed Puerto Rico while the crisis is going on. Okay. Twelve people all together failed. Um, this failed so bad that FEMA. Said fuck all this, canceled all of them. They have seven hundred thousand dollars, maybe, of supplies in a storage locker somewhere, mm-hmm. because FEMA just said, yeah, y'all fucked up. Because the first package they sent to the, uh, Puerto Rico, all the packages here was opened, like you know the dry food and all that type of shit. Yeah, fucked up. Like everything was fucked up from the get go, and now the lady is trying to sue FEMA. For an extra seven hundred million dollars or something like that, because she, I guess, do contracts through the subcontract that she hired to get the food to fucking Puerto Rico, mm-hmm. just all went left because she got like canceled the fuck out. And I'm breaking this up because uh, during all these crises, you know how not the, I don't want to say just the Puerto Rico crisis because it was hurricanes uh, somewhere else last year. I can't remember where. I, like, I think Texas, like, right? Was it it's Texas? Like three of them all on that, like uh, it was. It was. It was a lot. It was a lot of. It was a lot of coast. different hurricanes and everything like that. But I bring this up because I understand why rappers and everybody else had their own shit going on, and they don't trust fucking FEMA because shit like this happens. <laughs> so I kind of understood that. Like I understood why. Uh, like I know Trader Truth has one. Uh, I know um, what the fuck is it? Gronk Rob Gronk. Skowski, whatever the fucking name is. He played for the mm-hmm. Patriots. I know he has his own foundation. thing going on. But I understand why people have their own foundations and not trusting their FEMA and don't trust giving FEMA their fucking money. Because they just give a $153 million contract to one fucking person. And she is known for being one person, by the way. She is known. This is <laughs> one person. Oh, but Malcolm, there's even more deeper to this lady's story. She has been denied. No, she... she she wasn't supposed to be in this situation no way. FEMA wasn't supposed to get her no fucking money anyway because she has already been like denied like past fucking contracts from other companies. Mm-hmm. No, fuck other companies, nigga, from the United States, my nigga. Oh. Like period. Like she like fe- she she like federally wasn't supposed to get this shit until like January two thousand nineteen. Like she wasn't wasn't supposed to be able to get no con no federal contracts until two thousand nineteen, my nigga. Mm. And they still gave her as one hundred fifty million dollars. So That's yeah, crazy. don't trust FEMA because <laughs> obviously they don't know what the fuck they're doing. And the thing, the also thing that made it funny because I watched the video this morning. She blamed she blamed it more on the lady because they had the lady that she had uh, the subcontract with that through Atlanta, which is a the lady from Atlanta owns a catering company with like 11, 12 people. Mm-hmm. They had the main lady um, Tiffany Brown and the lady from Atlanta on the video. And both of them blamed FEMA because they weren't, um, I don't want to, I forgot what the fuck term they used, but they claimed to not have enough support <laughs> or some 
shit like help that. or some shit. Yeah. But then they hire all those people. Hundred and fifty three million dollars worth of help, my nigga. Like you can you could find some help. <laughs> <laughs> my nigga, like I didn't get what the fuck that was about. But yeah, so that shit happened. And I kind of understood like why people don't trust to get their yeah, money just to, to uh, hire shit, bigger known brand name fucking type of charities because shit like this happens. Like that's hundred fifty million three million dollars. I don't even know if it's down the drain or if they just gave her like in subs, like like in gave her like like a stipend, or something. yeah, some shit like that. I don't know if they even did that because she's asking for seven hundred seven hundred million dollars just so she could pay off to eleven other <laughs> people that she has a contract with, or the fuck the case is. So yeah, that happened. Money. Yeah, there's a whole lot of 